Hey, this is Ryan from Web Eminence, and in 2016, I did a video on the pricing plans for the Wix website builder, but a lot has changed since then. So in this video, I want to go through the pricing levels in just a few minutes, show you what premium plans are available with the Wix website builder, and let you know what's changed in the last few years. So the first thing that's important to point out is the free plans do still exist. I actually have an account running on a free plan and there are a lot of limitations, but the main limitation, like I pointed out in the video a few years ago, is that they will show Wix ads on your site if you have a free website. So the, the main ad is at this top toolbar here where it says the site was designed with Wix.com website builder. So that's going to be on your website and it looks like depending on your design it might stick to the top and it also says proudly created with wix.com in the footer you might be able to remove this I'm not sure but I think it's gonna stay there if you have a free site so you get a lot for free but I think this um, getting this ad removed is probably gonna be worth it for most people to switch to the first plan I'll actually link to another video I created about a business card I found in a local business who was actually using a free URL and they're kind of ugly like this uh, you see here but it doesn't keep some people from using it and even putting it on a business card. So one of the biggest changes in the new pricing is that they removed the connect domain plan which was available in the old pricing structure for five dollars per month. This basically allowed you to connect your domain so you could get rid of these ugly free domains that Wix gives you. However, this was removed in the US, so um, it might be removed worldwide, but as of right now, it's not available in the US, and you would have to upgrade to their lowest plan, which is called Combo, and it's $13 a month currently, and you would need to do that in order to connect your domain, and then connecting your domain is available on all other plans. You can purchase your domain through Wix, uh, when you set up your site or you could go purchase from a site like GoDaddy. I'll link to another video I did on searching and buying uh, a domain name from GoDaddy and then another question I answered on you know what the best domain registrar is to purchase your domain from. So to get into the actual price list and features here another change I want to point out is now they separate websites from business and e-commerce sites so if I click this link here there's different pricing for business sites or e-commerce sites that accept online payments. So I'm going to show you the website pricing first. And again, it starts with combo and then that has some limitations on bandwidth storage. It does allow you to connect your domain. It removes the Wix ads. And then another new feature they have is video hosting. So they allow for 30 video minutes. Uh, and then there's a free domain for a year as well. So this plan probably makes a lot of sense for people who just want to use their custom domain name. And then you go up to unlimited and then that just adds $300 in ad vouchers from Google Ads and then access to two apps, Site Booster app, which is like a search engine optimization app, and then uh, Visitor Analytics app, which just gives you more analytics on your website. And that is $17 a month. I will show you some options for lowering that monthly price when I get through these prices, but there are ways to do that through you know, paying three years in advance or one year in advance. If we go up to the pro version, they say this is the best value. Uh, you do get more bandwidth and storage as you move up these plans, like 10 gig on unlimited, 20 gig on the pro. I don't think many people will run into issues with storage or bandwidth. You get more video hours, you still get a free domain name and a $300 ad voucher site booster app visitor analytics you do get an event calendar so it looks like you can just add events to your website in a calendar form to display those and then you get access to a free actually you get yeah you get access to the professional logo maker um, so this is a newer feature with wix that i haven't tested out but basically it allows you to answer a handful of questions and it'll just generate a bunch of logos for you and then you can use those on your website and elsewhere and then as part of the pro plan, you also get social media logo files that says 40 different si sizes of your logo ready to use on your social media channels. So I believe they'll just create those versions of the logo for you uh, from that professional logo maker that I just showed you. If you go up to the VIP level, I believe the only difference there is that they give you priority response in your questions uh, on the Wix, uh, the help desk 
ticket system, and then VIP support that says skip the line with exclusive phone support. So this might make sense for some people who feel like they need a lot of help. You could upgrade to VIP for a while, and then maybe once your site is built, you could downgrade um, if you don't need as much support after that. So those are the website plans. Again, they go from $13 a month to $39, and I will show you in a minute uh, what the pricing would be if you paid you know, yearly. But let's look at the business and e-commerce plans real quick. It should give you a lot of the same features, starting with business basic, but they, you know, they add the online payments and the e-commerce platform that I covered in another video. Uh, it says 100% commission free, so they're not going to charge any transaction fee. You're just going to pay the process payments, which is, you know, your typical 3%. These all have unlimited bandwidth. They do have different levels of storage. They have more video hosting. And then they have some of the same features like the, the apps, logo maker on the unlimited plan. So they kind of mirror the website plans, but obviously are more expensive and include the e-commerce. And then the VIP plan, again, just adds the priority support. They do have an enterprise level solution that's going to maybe make sense for some larger companies. Uh, but I would think most getting to this level are going to want a more custom website and not use a website builder. But if you're a larger company you're already using Wix, you could look at this as a um, option. So if I go into my free website builder account in Wix, I can click upgrade to premium and it's going to show me those same premium plans. And let's say I wanted to just upgrade to unlimited, for example, which says $17 a month. I'm going to select that. And I just wanted to show you these discounts that are available. So it is $17 paid yearly. So those prices I was showing you were actually yearly. If you were to go to monthly, um, it says they don't include a free domain, premium apps, or ad vouchers, and it's $22 a month. Um, and then if you went to two years or paying three years in advance, the price goes down substantially. So you're saving $200 or $360. So it's a good value there if you know you're going to keep your website for long term. Um, there's a 14 day money back guarantee on these premium plans. So you could try them out for a while. But if you haven't used Wix, check out my full review on that. I'm going to update that soon as well because they're always adding features. So make sure to subscribe so you can check out that future video. But you can sign up and start using the free website builder uh, just using my link below in the description. And that's a good way just to get familiar with how the website builder works. I'll link to my full review of the Wix website builder and we'll see you on that video.